So that head sounded really good. It felt really good. Uh, um, and that's what I needed to do with that snare drum. And I'm going to use it tomorrow night when I play at Steakhouse 85. Um, but like I had originally said, as far as this series is concerned, is I wanted to talk about Amadia cymbals. Oh, and this snare drum. This snare drum, which I got uh, a few years ago, is from the 1930s. It's a Ludwig snare, and it's almost completely original, including the single flange hoops and the clips here. This isn't the original snare throw off. I believe it's a Gibraltar one, but it looks very similar to the original. And uh, it's a Ludwig butt plate, but it's been retrofitted with a spacer on there, so there weren't any additional holes added for this thing. Um, and it's, it's a great snare drum. Uh, and it's for sale. But uh, just like I'm telling everybody uh, that's what that our group is for. If anybody has something that they're looking to get rid of, musically speaking, or in the art community, or photography, or if you're promoting a show or something that you want to sell, go ahead. Anyway, these Comagene hi-hats that I was talking about before, they were like the first symbol that I got from a mania. And they're very soft symbols. They have like a lot of flex to them, which I like. And as far as I'm concerned, they're great for rock music and jazz. sound that I like um, and uh, dynamically speaking it's great because you can get really quiet with them and they don't have any kind of a growl that I've noticed some symbols uh, symbols are when they tend to be stiff um, these are also both the media ride symbols this one here with this sizzle chain that I designed a long time ago it's actually two sizzle chains that I put together this one uh, is the Ahmet Legend series. I believe it's a 21 inch symbol. And Ahmet, who owns the company, Amelia in Turkey, he, he made this symbol. I think he made these hi hats. Oh, yeah. And this fusion ride symbol is the first of its kind that came to this country. Uh, Dominic showed it to me. He knew that I would love it right away. Ahmet made this too. Anyway, this kind of masks the sound a little bit. So I'm going to take the sizzles off. Um, this symbol, the Ahmet Legend, the 21, it just has such an old quality to its sound, and it's, it's just a huge sounding symbol. symbols 13 years ago and then just about a year or two afterwards Dominic really knew exactly what I liked and this was the first of its kind again uh, in the United States called fusion 
immediately I was kind of surprised by the uh, hammering pattern that's on the symbol, but uh, it's got an engraved look to it, almost like a leaf uh, with olives on it or something. It's a very strange kind of a stamp hammer that they use, but it has a very cool quality to it. it just, uh, the, the, everything about it, the, the way it moves, uh, the way it sounds in different positions. share some qualities although I felt like this symbol had kind of moved to the next level of what I was looking for after I found this one. But I like to use them together. responsible stuff like paperwork.